I could be wrong here, but were you second to the ball on that on that snap on the first snap? How did you let Jackson jump go each way? Well, he already had a five-yard head start since he was uh, in a three-point stance. So if you notice, when he got to the ball, I was only two yards behind him. So I had uh, sucked him up about three yards and about ten yards. So uh, I was getting there. I was getting there slowly but surely. And then you tackled him. And then yeah, it was out of frustration. <laughs> yeah, it was a freshman mistake. You know to knock the first guy out the way and let the second guy scoop and score. He decided to fall on it. I didn't get to score. Hence tackle. You know what I mean? Rookies. Well, how, how much do you kind of welcome this week? No more spread. You kind of bear down and go get go hit some people. And yeah, stuff. we're uh, we're real excited. You know, it's a, it's a change of pace, change of tempo. Uh, Tech, Wyoming, and Rice are all real spread teams. You know, zone kind of running style. But uh, UCLA is back to you know smash mouth, <coughs> run downhill. And um, we try to consider ourselves, you know, a diverse defense. We can play against the spread. We can play, play against a downhill running game. So we're really excited for the challenge UCLA presents us, and uh, we're just ready to see what's in store. I think you're the number one rush defense in the country right now. But that's, is that kind of misleading because of who you played, or is it, you know, kind of welcome that right now and say now we can kind of get a chance to prove that's who we are? Um, I think it's more, you know, now we get a chance to try and continue to withhold, uphold that stat. Um, uh, it's just, like I said, UCLA presents a different challenge rushing the ball. I know they, I think, average more than 200 rushing yards a game. So that will be a great challenge, a fun challenge for the defense, and, uh, you know, we're all up to the task. Um, you, I know last week we focused a lot more on the pass since, you know, Tech passed maybe 80% of the time. But with a team that averages over 200 yards rushing the ball, now you really just got to hunker down. You know, the defensive line, they have to really focus on striking the guy right in front of them. Us as linebackers, we have to focus on attacking and getting off of blocks. And um, it's a lot more emphasis on the running game as opposed to, you know, dropping back and how to fit your zone perfectly. Now it's a lot more more um, emphasis on, you know, where, what gap you should be in on each and every running play. So it's a bigger <laughs> emphasis on the running game itself. Coach Brown talked about the stat time of possession. It was like almost more than 15 minutes. The offense for you guys was on the field than the defense was. Is that difficult at all? Do you, do you need to be on the field a little more sometimes, do you feel? Um, I like to be on the field more to help boost the statistics. But um, <laughs> I, mean, I don't really mind getting the rest. I know in the first quarter we only played like two or four minutes or something like that. So you get a little bored on the sideline. But, um, no, it's great for, the, great for the offense, you know, them moving the ball, them rushing the ball, giving us time to rest. And it's a team effort because, uh, you know, defensively I believe we had maybe eight or three and outs or so. So um, it's just a team effort to be able to go on the field on defense and get off and then let our offense go and just run the ball, pound the ball, and try to burn time off the clock. And it does give you more quality time with Coach Muschamp, doesn't it? Yeah, and it's all about quality time with, with Coach Muschamp.